All right, let's do something with this day. All right, I need to get ready and get out of here quick. And so I don't need to be messing around with no shower or nothing like that. Let's see if I can just get changed real quick, like uh, do a quick little spin, like a. Uh, oh. All right. That's a lot easier. Come here, Zeus. Oh, Zeusy. Oh, Zeusy, you smell so clean. Oh. Zeus just got back from the groomer. Yeah. Heck yeah, buddy. You're smelling fresh now. Oh, Still yeah. He's shedding a lot, but. Yeah, he is. It's all over me. You should have seen the pile of hair. Like, it was literally this tall. <laughs> And like this big around, like and keeping. <laughs> he's probably still losing fur for yeah. for summer. He's getting rid of his winter coat still, probably. Oh, I feel like I'm covering it. What do you think, dude? You like that? You like that? Oh. Well, he certainly smells better. That's for sure. <laughs> Looking good, brother. I have got to get out of here and get some stuff done. I gotta pay for my Jeep. And I wanted to go. I wanted to go and stop and see my buddy Bill, who's helping me with this project. Um, hopefully, he's home by the time I get done with that. You know what really blows? Veronica's phone is broken. Her back glass on her iPhone, it's broken. Still on vacation. Yeah, still. I'm really sorry about that. But I ordered. I ordered a replacement, and I was like, oh, cool. They send you this really cool. They send you a free uh, screen protector. And then I looked at the actual back glass and I was quite disappointed because, well, it's, it's broken too. So, so I gotta get on Amazon, I gotta contact the seller, I gotta submit a claim, I gotta send this back in, I gotta wait for them to send us another one. It could take potentially, I don't know, another five years or something. So I'm gonna send this back. And uh, I don't know, I gotta go take care of some stuff. So you guys are coming with me. I was looking at my brakes the other day and I still haven't had a chance to figure out what kind of pads and rotors and everything that I need for this car. Uh, so I came here to Napa to get that all figured out. All right, well, they didn't seem too awful friendly in there, but uh, I still got some of the specs and numbers that I need uh, to figure out what parts I need to fix the brakes on this car. Which is good, it's progress. Uh, so now I think I'm gonna head to Lowe's or Office Max, one of the two. Actually, I don't think we have an Office Max in this town. It's probably gonna be Staples. And see if I can't track down a whiteboard. Uh, Lowe's is the place where I'm gonna try and find this material that you can use for a whiteboard. And would you look who I ran into? Look who I found here, my buddy Seth. Look at this old geezer. What are you, doing, <laughs> man? you got a new camera? No, this is the old 110. Oh. It's the 110. It's a little guy. What happened to the scratchy one? I scrapped it. It's got a scratch on the lens, so I had to so this move one. back to this guy. <laughs> All right, I think we found a solution here. Marker. It's even called marker board. We didn't look at that, bro. <laughs> Seriously, marker board. All right, this little guy is ten dollars, but the guy, the guy who pointed us in the direction, he said that it might not erase off of it. But hell, what's ten dollars to try it out? We're getting it. We're getting that piece. On the back of your shower door, a lot of people put like uh, those mirrors, right? And they have those little, oh, yeah. those little uh, Morocco clips. Morocco clip. Is that what that is? That's what it is. Let's do it. Where do we find the Morocco clip? <laughs> we got these mirror clips that just simply butt up against the wall and kind of like have a little flange to hold on to the edge of this. Four of them on each corner. Buck fifty, ten dollars. So for 12 bucks, I got me a pretty awesome size whiteboard. Now I just need dry erase markers. I'll tell you what, this dude looks really comfortable in his job. Just cleaning them floors. Cleaning them floors. Oh, where'd he go? I'm lost. It was a pleasure Always. having your help. I would not have found that marker board without you. Nope. No, this is my good buddy Seth. Uh, dude, I'll see you again soon. Yes, sir. Peace out. Have a great day. So I got the mar I got the whiteboard. I'm dying to put it up. I'm dying to put it up. 
but I can't put up this whiteboard without a dry erase marker, you know, to write on it. So I gotta stop here at Staples and see what it would have cost me for a traditional whiteboard and get some dry erase markers. This is so funny, check this out. So this same dry erase board, the same size I got, 50 bucks. 50 bucks for this little frame here. Eraser with a little caddy, you can stick it to the wall. I'm good, I'm so good. And while I'm in town, Veronica really wants some Chipotle. So I'm gonna cruise on down to Chipotle and pick up some food for the lovely lady. Love cruising in the summertime with the windows down. It's a beautiful evening. Put the radio up. Listen to some sail. Look what I brought you, honey. Pope Lai. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome, honey. Well, dig in. I gotta hurry up and eat. Bill called me. Uh, if you remember Wild Bill's Shop of Wonders. Uh, we're working on a project. He's made some headway. So I'm gonna go over there right after I eat and, uh, you know, see what the progress is. Is that cool with you? Sure. Good. Awesome. That's why I love Veronica. She's she's a yes man woman. Yes woman. For the most part. <laughs> I was gonna say, where's the boys? I don't even hear them at all. They're actually playing quietly they, they, and nicely. I thought they were sleeping. They weren't making any noises. Let's see if we can find them. Ah, oh, pooper. What are you doing? <laughs> this is Spider-Man, where's Colin? Where's Batman, where's Carson? Where's my kids? We're in these suits. You're in the suit. Ooh. What? You're in the suit? And this is our bat cave. Oh, there's Carson. Ooh. There's <laughs> Carson. <laughs> All right, I gotta go. I'm going to see Bill. I'll be back in a while. Mm. Love you. So the last time I was here, Bill must have sparked his interest on opening up the project book on this hot rod, because now it's all torn apart. <laughs> he was like, "Man, I can't bear to I can't bear to look at this thing under cover anymore. I gotta I gotta get it going." So he started to look at. I mean, look at the progress. You got the whole fuselage off of it. Yeah, it is what it is. <laughs> He's almost got it started. The only thing is what? These carburetors? Carburetors. What are they? Stromberg. Stromberg carburetors. If anyone knows anything about Stromberg carburetors, what are you having the issue? They're just not opening up? I don't know a thing about Stromberg carburetors. He, he don't know a thing about them. They're from England. He wants this thing to run. So point me in the direction of some information on Stromberg carburetors. So we can get this thing, you know, burning rubber. For old Bill. Old Bill. I mean, I mean Wild Bill. <laughs> <laughs> so my visit today with Wild Bill is gonna be a short one. It's a short one. I can't divulge all of the, you know, all of the details about our secret little project here quite yet. But it's coming along nicely, I have to say. And uh, Bill has worked diligently on helping to make this thing a reality. Again, I want you guys to give a very, very big, special thank you to my good friend, Wild Bill. You're welcome. He heard you. It's time for me to go home because Veronica and the boys miss me. And I want to make sure to get home to give them hugs and kisses before bed. You know how that goes, Bill? Yes, I do. I remember. All, all of Bill's kids moved out. They're all grown and out. They're all your age. Yeah, they're my age. <laughs> Which is why he gets to be in this wonderful man cave that we call Wild Bill Shop Wonders. It's a, it's a beautiful place. It really is. <laughs> Say goodnight, Bill. Goodnight, Bill. Very good. I love hanging out with Bill, man. Bill's an awesome guy. And, uh, 
this project that we're working on is it's, it's really cool it's a it's something that I can offer to the public that's kind of like I don't know I'm trying to create a product and I think it's a valuable product that any any other videographer or filmmaker could appreciate I think it's something that could be very very useful uh, if you were I'm gonna give you a hint if you were conducting interviews all right we got to give Zeus his eye drops yeah everyone's concerned we got to actually film getting his eye drops in okay okay can you film for me hey, yeah. Dad. these are just like toothbrushes Zeus. and they're bones Zeus. hey on. lay down lay down oh, that's a bone. Lay down. Uh, um, right, these are just like boy. toothbrushes uh, except they're bones yeah to your eye. <laughs> it's okay, Zeus. Carson. Carson. And they're just like I don't know whatever. The they're this. just milk bones. <laughs> and yeah, and they clean oh, their teeth. Yeah. yeah. There's a very cute dog on the box. There's a very awesome dog. Okay. There's one. You missed it. Roll over. Over this way. Good boy. Let's do this one. <laughs> Get that. Hold on. It's okay, Zuzi. It's, okay. it's okay. It's okay, boy. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Milk bone after. Okay. All done. I'll rub it in there for you. Oh, there you go, buddy. You're there welcome. you go. Good boy, Zeus. No. Good boy, Zeus. <laughs> What do you say to me? Now it's time to get to Jesus. Thanks for filming, Carson. <laughs> He's breathing all heavy. <laughs> the boy's got a laugh out of him. Someday we'll have to get the boy as a dog. Because they really have fun with Zeus. As soon as we can buy a house, if we buy that house, then we can get a dog. But we need to... We need to not rent. Then we can have a dog. Eventually. And you want a dog, don't you? Yeah. And you want a dog too, don't you? Uh, kitty. You want a kitty? <laughs> Look, there, this is Veronica's dedication. It's it's a little past midnight. And she's down here smashing out these orders. I guess this is what happens when you live where you work. Mm -hmm. You. You wake up, make your cup of coffee or hot tea or hot cocoa and walk down the basement and work. You ready to do that for some gladiator t-shirts? Sure. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Smile, honey. Be happy. <laughs> That's the after midnight smile, by the way. <laughs> Four more labels and then I can carry her up to bed. I, t I told someone, someone commented on today's video something about Chase never, he'll never reply, reply to this comment. So I was like, oh yeah? I'll reply to every single comment on this video. So you'll find yesterday's video, I responded to every single comment every single one. So if there isn't a reply on the comments because you commented after I did a comment spree. <laughs> All right guys, that's about it for today. Thanks for coming with me to do, you know, random stuff. Tomorrow, we're going back to my house to put up the whiteboard and we're gonna draw something on it. We're gonna draw something on it. I wanna see that, I wanna see if those dry erase markers actually erase off of that. Sometimes you have to get a spray cleaner. Like it'll come off, but it'll leave kind of like residue. So you have to get the spray cleaner. Yeah. I think what if I put what if I put Rain-X on it? Yeah, that'd probably work. Or like some sort of repellent. Repellent, yeah, like a I don't know, then that might make it spot. I don't I don't know. We'll play with it. We'll figure it out. And then if it works uh, I don't know if I put all the information like what I bought 
Aunt Lowe's what, what it was. I think it was called Marker Board. But if it works, I'll put together a little uh, tip video for you guys to make a cheap DIY whiteboard. I'm and sure. we're going on a dinner date tomorrow. Oh, that's right. We're going to Outback to take Veronica out to dinner because she deserves it. She's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, that's all we got for you today. We will see you right back here. Tomorrow.